What kind of dog is that? Michael is just a part of everything we do. Michael is a non-releasable Eurasian Eagle Owl. Michael is and always will be a wild animal. She's not domesticated by any means, she's tamed. That happens with the imprinting process. We're the family now. My baby bird. I'm her mom. My kids are her siblings. So I spent every day, all day with her. <laughs> that's, that's my nose or... She went in the car. She went to school drop off. When my nine-year-old gets home to do her homework, Michael will intentionally come over and sit on the couch with her. And she'll just preen her hair or play with the toys. To them, it's just like living with another sibling. They're gonna grow up and be like, oh my God, I can't believe that I lived in the house with an owl. Michael, why do you have to lay with the kids? I would never let any animal around my children unsupervised. There's a mutual respect between the three of them. She is incredibly gentle. Get him, get him, get him, get him. She's a goofball, man. Hey. Any paper she can get a hold of, she shreds into little bits and pieces. Oh my God. She likes taking things and hiding them. Whatever they are, it doesn't matter. If she can find them in a corner, she'll take them. Michael. Give me the yarn. You don't knit. Okay. Can I keep it? Between her and the toddler, yeah, it's just never ending. Michael. That's not where owls go. Michael. Now everybody gets to see, you know, this beautiful, wonderful, big creature. And she's sentient and loving and funny. While Michael is wonderful and sweet, I am somebody that holds two licenses, a state and a federal license that allows me to handle and work with birds of prey. I spend from day until nighttime working with these birds. And without that experience and the licenses, I would never recommend that anybody do what I'm doing. Handling these birds without understanding what you're doing is just extremely dangerous. Did you get it? Instead of doing good for the community of wildlife and conservation, it could scare people and do the exact opposite of what a lot of us are trying to build, which is respect and understanding of these animals. I hope she lives a very long, fulfilled, wonderful, happy life, and I will take care of her forever. I hope she lives 70 years. <laughs>